Joining me now is Maria Vanderhoek, Special Events and Community Coordinator at Ronald McDonald House Charities Central Alberta. Why don't you start off by explaining what this house is designed for? So we are a caring and supportive home away from home for families that must travel to Red Deer to receive their child's medical treatment. We also serve a large number of Red Deer local families through our day use program. So they can use the house's amenities during the day while their child is in the hospital as well. So we've opened our doors in 2012 and in that time we've served over 3,000 families. So that's including our extended stay families and our local day use families. And this wouldn't be possible without the help of a lot of volunteers and different fundraisers. And one of those fundraisers is coming up right away. Why don't you start off by explaining what the Freeze the House charity bond spiel is? Oh, you got it. So we are in our fifth anniversary for our Freeze the House charity bond spiel. So it's a weekend fun spiel. We get curling teams in different divisions come together at the Paderni Centre. We have various activities, curling celebrities, John Morris and Carter Rycroft, a dinner and dance on our Saturday evening but if you're not a curler and you're still looking to support the house we have our dinner and dance gala on February 20th at the Sheraton Red Deer Hotel so you can come out and show your support for our, our families with sick children by purchasing one of those tickets. And if anyone wants to purchase tickets for that uh, how can they go about doing that? So online at www.rmhcentralalberta.org or you can give me a shout 403-340-2007 and we can do it over the phone. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Maria. She's going to take me on a tour of the Ronald McDonald House. Welcome back to the show. Maria is still giving us a nice little tour of the Ronald McDonald House. And uh, first off, why don't you explain what's going on right behind us? So these guys here are part of our Home for Dinner program, which is a donation and volunteer program all wrapped into one. So groups will purchase groceries, come into the house, and prepare a meal for our families. It's great team building for the groups that come in. They get to see the impact of their donation right in front of them as they eat dinner with our families. And it's great stress relief for mom and dad. If that's, they've spent the entire day at the hospital dealing with doctors and nurses, the last thing that they want to do is come back to the house and try to figure out what they're going to make for dinner. So this program is in place that they, so that they don't have to worry about it. And if someone wants to get involved with that program, is there a way they can do that? Yeah, it's really easy. So right now we have over 90 home for dinner groups. So all you have to do is call into the house and say that you're interested in and being one of those groups. We'll get you in for an orientation and then from there you just schedule your dates. Okay, Maria, we have made it to easily the coolest room in the entire house. Why don't you explain what the magic room is? Well, firstly, I totally agree with you. So the magic room is a special room that we bring families to for a couple of different reasons. One being maybe a birthday or a milestone in a child's treatment or a child's feeling a little bit scared about a procedure that they might have at the hospital the next day or simply that they get to go home. We think it's a great way to finish off your journey with Ronald McDonald. Donald House by visiting this special farm themed room. So we bring families in here to kind of say goodbye. Um, so even though we serve a high number of families that have infants in the neonatal intensive care unit and the infant isn't going to remember their journey with the house, we'll still bring parents in here as a special farewell. Um, behind the door is a full closet completely stocked full of toys. So children are welcome to go back there and take a toy home. Okay, Maria, we've made it to the end of our tour, going to the one place that I think people will spend the most time, the family suites. Why don't you talk about uh, what this room is all about? So at our house, we have 11 family suites. Each suite comes equipped with two queen beds, a full storage unit, and a private bath. We're also able to get cribs and cots into the room, so really we can accommodate up to a family of six. Um, if you'll notice, we don't have any televisions in our rooms, and that's because we encourage families to gather in the common areas, mingle with other families, get to know them, befriend them, because who can relate more than another family going through a similar circumstance? Stance. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Maria, for this tour. It's the There's No Place Like Home dinner and dance going on during the Freeze the House charity bond spiel. If you would like any more information, you can visit the websites on your screen.